The deadline for many higher education students to apply for financial aid is quickly approaching. It's the last chance for them to receive a portion of the $14 billion the federal government handed out to help students affected by COVID-19. KXAN education reporter Alex Capriello shows us who's eligible to receive the assistance. Financially, it hit me. 21-year-old Giselle Ortiz was only a few months into her training program at Southern Careers Institute when COVID-19 hit. She's now full-time online and working 30 hours on the weekends just to support her mom and sister. I have to put extra effort in just because this virus is going on. I even have to work harder than before. We encourage uh, all of our students to, to get on there and, and make their application by the deadline tomorrow. Ortiz is one of 1,500 students at Southern Careers Institute to apply for the federal grants meant specifically for students impacted by the coronavirus. Her school will hand out half of the $6 million it received to students who apply by tomorrow. For Texas State and UT Austin, over $15 million is earmarked apiece. We're really grateful to the federal government and the CARES Act uh, for providing these grants for students so that they can uh, stay focused on, on their education um, and continue down the path. Higher education experts have expressed some frustrations with the process. The money has been slow to get to the universities, causing tight turnaround times. Not everyone is eligible. You have to be a U.S. citizen, enrolled in in-person coursework, and you can't be in default of any student loans. There's no guarantee that Ortiz will even get the money that she needs, but she's still encouraging others to apply just like her. We're all in this together. Alex Capriello, KXAN News. Schools have to decide how to use the other half of the federal money. Austin Community College said they will spend a portion of new technology for online learning. Southern Careers Institute leaders say it will go towards putting new safety protocols into place. As Alex mentioned, the University of Texas has more than $15.7 million to cover student expenses. The application went live a week ago. The university says it's sifting through applications as quickly as possible. There's no deadline to apply at this point. Texas State University created the Bobcat Cares Fund for its students. $30 million will go towards students' needs. More than half of that fund comes from the Cares Act. The application for Bobcat Cares closes May 27th. UT and Texas State students will be notified by email if their application is accepted.